In 2018, Lady Gaga and Bradley Cooper stunned audiences in A Star Is Born. But did you know that this was the fourth version of the film to have been made in the past 80 years? Here is a look at all four versions of A Star Is Born. 1937 The original movie was made in Technicolor, released by Selznick International Pictures, and starred Jeanette Gaynor as Esther Blodgett, a North Dakota farm girl who dreams of becoming a Hollywood actress. Blodgett moves out to Hollywood to follow her dreams and meets Norman Maine, played by Frederick March, a fading movie star who helps Esther launch her acting career. Music for the film was composed by renowned composer Max Steiner, who also wrote music for Casablanca and Gone with the Wind. The film bears resemblance to another movie that was made four years prior in 1932 called What Price Hollywood? released by RKO Radio Pictures. RKO thought of filing a plagiarism lawsuit against Selznick International Pictures, but in the end, let it go. The film was nominated for eight Academy Awards and won two for Best Original Story and an Academy Honorary Award. 1954 this version was the first musical adaptation, and stars the incomparable Judy Garland as Esther Blodgett, and James Mason as Norman Maine. In this remake, Esther Blodgett is an aspiring singer and actress who meets Norman, a famous movie star who wants to help Esther make it in Hollywood, even if his own career isn't doing so hot because of his alcoholism. Filming began in October 1953, and though much footage had already been shot, Warner Brothers studio executives decided that this film would be their first in Cinemascope, and had to reshoot everything they had filmed up to then. The initial cut of the film ran for 196 minutes, but was cut down to 154 minutes due to concerns that the running time would limit the number of showings in a day. Unfortunately, Two major musical scenes and crucial dramatic scenes were cut out, and the director, George Kakor, said it was very painful to watch. The film was nominated for six Oscars including Best Actor, Best Actress, and Best Song for The Man That Got Away. Unfortunately, it didn't win any. Judy Garland had given birth to her son and couldn't attend the ceremony, so a television crew was sent to her hospital room in case she won the award, but it went to Grace Kelly instead. 1976 Following the musical romantic drama adaptation, this version stars Barbara Streisand and Chris Christopherson. Esther Hoffman, Streisand, a young aspiring singer meets and falls in love with self-destructive rock star John Norman Howard, Christopherson. However, just as her career skyrockets, Howard's is on the decline. Unlike the first two versions, this film focuses on the music industry instead of Hollywood. The film was a box office success, grossing over $80 million on a $6 million budget. It was the second highest grossing film of 1976 after Rocky. The soundtrack itself also did very well internationally, reaching number one in various countries. The film was nominated for four Academy Awards and won one for Best Original Song for Evergreen, Love Theme from A Star Is Born. 2018 the newest adaptation of A Star Is Born is most similar to the 1976 version and stars Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga. Jackson Jack Main is a hard-drinking country rock singer who falls in love with the ambitious singer Ali. In 2011, the film was set to begin with Beyonce as the female lead and Clint Eastwood directing. Various actors were approached for the male lead including Will Smith, Christian Bale, and Tom Cruise. Eventually in March 2016, Bradley Cooper signed on as director and male lead, while Lady Gaga was cast in August of the same year. 
The film was an incredible success worldwide, receiving praise for the performances, directing, and music. It was nominated for eight Oscars and won Best Original Song for Shallow. Maybe we'll see a fifth adaptation in about 25 years. Thank <laughs> you.